Hmm. Where is? You stopped communicating with someone. In the past, we had the page of pentacles in reverse. Either you were procrastinating a situation or you just stopped communicating with someone. You stopped putting in your effort. Right now, something stuck and stagnant with the world. Okay? You could be dealing with a Leo, Taurus, Scorpio or a Virgo. Something stuck and stagnant. Okay, Something's not moving. The world in reverse is a lack of closure probably. Could have been someone who just abruptly left a relationship and now its crossing is the seven of pentacles. Okay, You're waiting. You're waiting and pausing to reflect on the situation and you're trying to figure out if you want to continue to invest or not. Okay, On your mind is the ace of swords in reverse. Okay, So that could be either someone's life or there's just a lack of communication or there's just confusion or, clarity, or no clarity around the situation. Okay. Right now, the reason for the reading is the Nine of Cups. Okay, so someone is probably focusing on their happiness. Nine of Cups is a little smug, but someone's just self-indulgent or someone just wants a wish fulfillment, okay? But right now, the Nine of Cups is self-indulgent, okay? Taking care of yourself, doing what makes you happy. Coming into the future, the Knight of Wands in reverse, I think there is going to be a lack of action okay someone's not communicating overall energy we have the ten of cups in reverse someone needs is unhappy in a family situation okay the ten of cups in reverse could be a breakup could be a separation but it could also mean that someone's just not happy okay this is an unhappy family situation it could be uh, unfulfilling relationships or it could also be an unhappy um family environment that is draining you out emotionally okay i feel someone's leaving an unhappy family situation okay it could be including kids all right let's clarify or someone wants to if they haven't okay but this is the energy can the ten of cups in reverse why is the ten of cups in reverse as the overall energy for aquarius can for the ten of cups in reverse please yeah yeah so someone's unhappy and probably someone left I think someone left a marriage or um, a long-term commitment. I think it's marriage and now things have just come to, come to a complete halt, okay? In the world in reverse. Something's stuck in stagnant. Something's not moving forward. Someone's not learning their lessons, I'm guessing. They're repeating the same mistakes again and again. Or this is just negative patterns being repeated again and again. Clarify for the world in reverse. Why is the world in reverse? Someone's single. Yeah, someone left a relationship, someone left a marriage, okay, things have completely stopped, there's a lack of closure and someone's wanting to be single, someone's very much on their own, that's the energy, someone does not want to be in a marriage anymore. The nine of pentacles is realizing your worth, realizing your value, realizing your, your self-esteem, your, your self-respect, focusing on yourself and knowing what you're worth, this is knowing your worth and someone just got out. Because it was unhappiness. It was draining you out emotionally. So I have the page of pentacles in reverse. What is this page of pentacles in reverse in the past? Someone stopped communicating and putting in the effort into a situation with the devil. Could be dealing with the Capricorn. It was an unhealthy attachment, okay? You were obsessing about, about it or it was just a connection that you felt very tight and bound, very restricted to. And it was draining you out emotionally, alright? Life of the devil. Life of the devil. Yeah. Can give me one more card for the King of Wands. Life for the King of Wands. Yeah. So someone stopped invent investing into a connection that was very, very toxic. And they finally... Um, there was someone who knew what they wanted. Okay, The King of Wands is someone who's a go-getter. Okay, He knows what he wants. He's very committed, he's very, very loyal, and uh, probably they realize their value, they realize it's not what they want, and they got out with the death. Could be dealing with the Scorpio. The death is ending the new beginnings, okay? So someone gave rebirth to a situation. Something was, something, it's like the phoenix rising from the ashes, okay? Someone transformed themselves completely. 
Yeah. So, like I said, right, the King of Wands, he he does what he wants when he wants. Okay. He 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 when he takes a stand about something, he's dead serious about it. And someone ended a situation. All right, because it was just too toxic. They stopped investing into it. Why for the world in reverse? Why is the world in reverse as a current situation for Aquarius? Yeah, you're letting go of the past. Okay, the Six of Cups in reverse is having bitter memories about something. All right. Uh, it could be you holding a grudge against someone from your past, or you're just trying very hard to remove yourself from someone's life. All right. Clinging on to bad memories, holding on the past grudge, and just a lot of negative energy from the past. Okay, not the best memories of the past. All right. That's why you just left, and there was a lack of closure. Clap for the Six of Cups in reverse. Clap for the Six of Cups in reverse. Yeah. Someone had a lot of fear. Someone felt very restricted. Okay. This is a lot of stuck energy. Okay. Stuck. Restricted. Okay. A lot of fear-based energy. Clap for the Eight of Swords. What is this Eight of Swords? Clap for the Eight of Swords. Yeah, and then there was a lack of communication. That's why things just did not move forward because someone felt like they couldn't get out of this situation. They were stuck in their head, and someone just stopped communicating. There was just the communication came to a complete halt. You could be living at a distance from this person. All right, clarify the Seven of Pentacles. Now you're someone's reflecting. Someone's reflecting on the past. Like, should I invest in this or not? Clarify the Seven of Pentacles. Clarify the Seven of Pentacles. I don't think I, I think you're reflecting on the past, but I think you made a decision. You're not investing into this anymore. Eight of Pentacles in reverse, not focusing or not investing into something. Apply for the Eight of Pentacles. Apply for the Eight of Pentacles. Yeah, because see, subconsciously also you're focusing on what makes you happy. You're going to take care of yourself. The Nine of Cups, like I said, right? Yes, it is a little smug energy, but it is. It is someone who's going to do what makes them happy. Okay, it is someone who's emotionally and someone wants to be emotionally very, very satisfied and independent. Okay, this is doing what makes you happy. Okay, yes, it is happy, a wish fulfillment. But out here, I feel someone's just wanting to be very happy and content emotionally. Okay, someone feels it's okay. I'm okay with not investing into this relationship anymore. It was quite shitty in the past. I'm not repeating the same mistakes again, and I'm not going back to the past. Okay, because the past could be dealing with the soulmate with the six of cups. This was a soulmate connection, but there was something that left a bad taste in your mouth. Okay, and you're like, no, I'm just gonna do what makes me happy. I'm not doing this anymore. Clap for the Ace of Swords in reverse. Yeah, there is a lack of communication here, but there's someone here who's still stalking and spying on you. Okay, someone wants to communicate with you, or someone's just getting more information about you. Page of Swords is blunt communication. Clap for the Page of Swords. Yeah, someone wants to reconcile. On your mind is reconciliation, Aquarius. If this is you, you are probably there is no communication between you both. A lot of confusion, but you are stalking and spying on this person. Okay, you want reconciliation. You want to give this another try. Clap for the nine of cups here. What is the nine of cups here? Yeah, a, a more reflecting on the past. Okay, so I think you are very very confused. Of what makes me happy, all right? You still think that there probably are chances that the, this relationship does make you happy, but you're constantly between this place of should I invest in that? Is that what my happiness is, or should I not invest in that? Okay, I think that's what you're stuck in. Clap for the Seven of Pentacles. Clap for the Seven of Pentacles. I think you're very, very stuck, Aquarius. Clap for the Seven of Pentacles. You're stuck. If this is your wish fulfillment or not, but at the same time you're very very defensive with the seven of wands. Okay, you're standing your ground. I think you're just stuck. Yeah, you're between two places. Like I said, right? Should I invest into this? Is this my wish fulfillment? Will this make me happy, or should I not? And will that be my happiness? Okay, you're very very defensive defensive right now. You're standing your ground. You're not doing anything about it. You're just waiting and watching. That's what I feel you're doing. You're pausing, waiting and watching, not taking any action. A lot of thinking involved here. Clap for the Knight of Wands in reverse. Clap for the Knight of Wands in reverse. Yeah. In the future, I feel that there's a. You're probably going. To, there's going to be a very impulsive, reckless energy around you. Could be someone who's going to be very, very impulsive. But whoever this person is, right? There could be someone here who's coming in, okay, being very, very vulnerable, and they're going to express their feelings towards you. Knight of Cups is coming in with a love offer. 
that is the knight of cups in reverse but at the same time this could be someone who's very in and out of your life okay they could be very very um reckless like i said clarify the knight of cups in reverse okay yeah someone wants to regain control of the situation with the emperor you could be dealing with an aries could be dealing with a water sign could have water in your birth chart scorpio i'm seeing him but yes someone is coming in to get to offer stability into this relationship okay it's like i am here let's do this right okay if we're doing this let's do this right okay they're going to open up this could be someone who was shut down they wouldn't open up but the emperor to me is someone very very mature he's very committed okay he's usually a married man the emperor is someone stubborn little controlling but uh, yes this is someone who is not willing to bend to anyone's ways or wills okay they want complete control and authority order and stability but this person they put their emotions on the side and they think very logically someone coming in to ex express their feelings towards someone who was very very reckless first or you were the one who was very very reckless and impulsive you just didn't know whether you wanted this or not but you're coming in with an offer you're offering someone stability you're opening up to them emotionally clarify um clarify the 9 of pentacles one more time clarify the 9 of pentacles what's the 9 of pentacles as the overall energy for aquarius 9 of pentacles yeah you you're again you're contemplating if you still want to be single or you want this relationship with the two of pentacles you're trying to balance the situation balance two decisions there is you could have gone through a lot with this person but this is being very very indecisive okay you want to be single you realize your worth but you're still stuck again i'm saying you're still stuck if this relationship is going to give you the happiness make you happy or are you going to be happy on your own someone's coming in although someone who could be very reckless they're coming in to offer you their cup of love they want to take control of the situation but i don't know i don't know you you're more like i don't know give me one more card for the emperor what is this emperor card for the emperor card for the emperor please Oh my god that's a lot of stability stability security order um um someone uh, very controlling authority this is commitment this is marriage this is someone who stands their ground this is someone who's a boss runs their empire the king of pentacles commitment whoever is coming in they're not only coming in with a stupid emotional offer they're coming in with love they're coming in with order and stability and they're coming in with the commitment Wow, Aquarius! Either you're offering this to someone, or someone's coming in this to offer to you. Maybe you've lost passion for this person with the Knight of Wands in reverse, but there's someone here who wants who, who's this combination. Okay, this is kick-ass. I love this. Okay, Aquarius, you should give this a chance if this is someone coming towards you. All right, Aquarius, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please like, share, follow, subscribe. Leave your comments below, and I'll see you next time. Bye bye.